just a quick shot, but a powerful shot like that. Trust me, that shot not only buzzed Maloney, but it hurt him. Just time it. He thought, he thought Maloney was going to throw a shot. Maloney never threw the shot, so he beat Maloney to the punch with a beautiful straight right hand. Did you see the shoulder? That was a little nice little shoulder roll right there. Turn, boom. Right, right off. You can do this, Ace. You gotta back yourself, all right? All right, back yourself. You can do this. See, Jab's smashing his head back. Snapping his head. Yeah, put the right hand behind Five rounds in the book here inside the bubble at the MGM Grand alongside Tim Bradley and Andre Ward. And here is your scorecard, Dre. Yeah, it's a complete shutout. Uh, I don't think there's any, you know, questions about that. Um, you know, in a way, he's, you know, dominating this fight. He's put on a great performance. He's doing everything that he said he would do and that people expected him to do. Good body shot right there from in a way. I, if I could, if you could hear the thoughts that oh! shot right there. Down goes Maloney on a quick counter. In a way, it's a good finisher, too. Hey, okay? Okay? Come to me. Plus. 16 knockouts and 19 victories for Naoya Inoue. He comes out firing with that big left hook. And he smells blood. He may be the monster, but tonight he's a shark going after his prey in Jason Maloney from down under. Big right hand once again from Naoya Inoue. And Maloney has no choice but to tie up. There's that big left from Naoya Inoue, he follows it up with the right hand. And just the demeanor, Jason Maloney is continuing to change as Inoue finds that confidence level and that range. Body language in a boxing ring tells a story. And Inoue's body language is screaming that he's in control and Maloney is in survival mode right now, trying to weather this storm from that knockdown. There's another left hook, an uppercut from Naoya Inoue, who's finding every shot in his repertoire to punish Maloney with. Supreme focus from Naoya Inoue. And Maloney gets caught with another left hook as he leaves his jab out there. You can feel the power, you can hear the thuds when Inoue lands a shot. And he hasn't landed cleanly yet, except for that big shot early in the round. But he lands cleanly there with that right. It's a lot to deal with. Now oh, these are big, heavy shots coming, coming in on Maloney. You know, if, if I'm in his corner right now, you know, if he doesn't give me a, a better round, the next round, I'll probably end up stopping this match. I mean, he's taking a beating, and I want to save him for the rest of his career. Well, you got to do the math. How many rounds has he won? Does he have the power to stop in a way? And, and where is he at? What type of fight is he fighting? He's not fighting a fight where he's just missing big shots that could possibly knock in a way out. He's in survival mode, but he's taking a massive amount of punishment in the meantime. Yes, he is. That uh, inflammation over the left, the left eye of Jason Maloney as we're now at the halfway point of the fight. This knockdown happened so quickly that we're going to have to watch it here on the replay to break left it down. Hook. See how he got in position to throw this mm. left hook. Maloney came in with a double jab. You know, we're taught to, you know, step in behind with the double jab. And if you don't do it from the right distance, well, you get set up with shots like this. Beautiful left hook right in between. Nice step back, a half a step back. By in a way, nice check hook right there from him. A lot to deal with, fellas. Power, speed, quickness, timing, the whole nine. I mean, you know, the only shot, again, that Maloney has is to try to bring this fight inside and stay as close to in a way as possible. But here's the thing. When he gets in close, he's getting ripped with body shots and uppercuts. There's no place where Maloney is safe in this boxing ring. And speaking of safe, Kenny Bayless, the referee, just walked over to Jason Maloney's corner and told him, look, my job is to make sure that you're safe. Yeah. Show me something. That's good referee. Yes, it is. You know, you, you have big concern when you see a fighter taking big shots over and over and over like Maloney is. Let's not forget that 
Jason Maloney's brother, Andrew, will be fighting in a rematch against Joshua Franco. Ended up at the hospital and losing his world title here in the bubble a week before Maloney got his win against Leonardo Baez. So the twins have been through a lot together. And more importantly is he doesn't want to end up at the hospital tonight at the hands of Naoya anyway. And Tim, I, I love what you said again in that last round. You know, some may say, well, hey, Maloney's still in the fight. Don't look to stop it, but you got to do the math. Put all the e equation together. He doesn't really, he can hurt in a way if he lands the right shot, but he's not throwing with that kind of conviction right now because he doesn't want to get caught with a shot. In a way, he's not slowing down. And in a way, he's also not a guy that you drag him into deep water and he can't show up. He showed us in his last fight against Benito Tanir that he can not only dish it out, but he also can take it. Tall nice. order for Maloney. Nice right hand there from Jason. We're listening to his twin brother, Andrew Maloney, in the corner. Yes, beautiful. Oh, nice uppercut from anyway. Just a little lean with the jab from Maloney. More distance, guys. Come on, warm up. That's all it takes. Sports about inches, centimeters. Good job keeping it metric and. <laughs> <laughs> you are quite the academic. Thank you, sir. I try. Oh, look at that defense from Inouye. Now, Inouye's taking this round off, honestly. He's looking to play counterpunch with Maloney. Well, he took the first two minutes off, but here comes the onslaught of Inouye following a triple jab. It's not just the hands of Inouye, it's the feet. When a fighter can close the distance on you in a half a second, and he's, all, he's up on you, quicker than you can even imagine. That's unnerving for a fighter. It's tough to deal with. Look at that. Every time the hands leave Maloney's face, there's always a counter coming back from anyway. Unreal. Uh, no, 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 no. seventh round and what a right hand it was in a way started this fight the way that he ended it he just got on fire he 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 revved up his engine and he was all gas and no brakes he did everything he showed speed he showed power he showed some flavor with his feet and you know he ended with a devastating right hand like that maloney just made a mistake threw a, threw a jab out there and and in a way just took a took a half little step back and mm. just made him pay with a just, brutal shot you saw that coming. We were talking about this over the last couple rounds. It doesn't look like much is happening, but there's a lot happening. And you see, in a way, a guy with an IQ setting up a shot like that to have an emphatic victory here in the United States. There's a lot of people that are going to start to know this young man's name. And, and if he continues to go to the like this, he will. 